is just a feeling that if anybody can, maybe Liverpool can. Uh, modern history is decorated with drama, and because of that, Liverpool are the team who may just think they can do it. But they'll have to do it without Steven Gerrard. We all know Rafa Benitez likes his facts, but his team need to rewrite the facts and figures books to stay in the Champions League tonight. They've got to turn sometime, anytime tonight. Maybe now as Lucas puts Alex under pressure. Well, Alex was just a little too casual then. I mean, that's not a good touch. That was nervy. And Aurelio will take this free kick. Check punches rather nervously. Alonso couldn't really get hold of it. There were some half-hearted appeals for handball and Certainly, Petr Cech looked a little uncertain during that Blackburn onslaught in the second half here on Saturday. Just come infield here, slipped into Ben Hume, that's clever. Here's Fernando Torres! <laughs> if Liverpool are to pull this off, you feel they've got to take most, if not all, of their clear-cut chances. Well, that's what I'm talking about, early goal or not, that's what you want to see in Liverpool's play. It's Lampard, and it's almost through, Rayner, I think, have the post cover. Well, he's taking a chance, isn't he, Pepe Reina, with Frank Lampard, we know how well he can strike them. And just to have two in the wall, Chelsea player added to it. OK, he's got it covered, but I think it's just a little risky business. Too much space in front of that back four. It's just a strange psyche for competitive modern footballers. This is the uh, foul that produced the free kick, which was uh, debatable. Aurelio will deliver this free kick. Oh, he's gone for goal! Look at that! Look at that! Surprise, surprise! Petr Cech, totally embarrassed by a brilliant piece of improvisation by Fabio Aurelio. And I wonder, is that the moment when Liverpool begin an assault on the summit? Well, that's absolutely fantastic for Aurelio. Just the spot that Petr Cech is just completely expecting him to float one into the box. And he's just drilled it low near post and the keeper just doesn't react in time. Rolled it through. Fernando Torres is onside. Here's Yossi Benayoun. It was Ivanovic who got back there. Was that a back pass? No. I don't think so. I think Ivanovic just got his toe to it. It's Aurelio. Oh, he's found a way through Skirtles there, but there's... Oh, there's no flag up. Oh, he's given a penalty. A penalty to Liverpool. Some holding inside the penalty area. And with 27 minutes played, Liverpool can take one huge step closer to their dream result. Xabi Alonso, well, he took a penalty in the midst of that incredible Liverpool trio of goals in Istanbul. Alonso, anything is possible, anything. Less than a third of the game gone, and Liverpool are two-thirds of the way to their target without Steven Gerrard. Well, Xabi Alonso had that penalty saved, you may remember, in that final in 2005, but managed to scramble in the rebound. That was the equalising goal following the efforts from Gerrard and Schmitzer. You can't possibly say that Liverpool could trump that tonight. That was the final when all said and done. Here is Ivanovic. Down he goes. Carragher's challenge, nothing doing. Well, every decision this referee takes is going to be a contentious one from here. Well, here comes the change. It will be a uh, drop bar with the header on. Lampard's there. Good defending by Alonso. Well, he's the one that's been tracking Frank Lampard. Well, Chelsea team now. Lampard clips in. Big climb at the far post by Alex. But Seized by Reina. It's awkward. Carvalho and Ivanovic were up together there at the far post. Count jumping against Cole. Oh, and just beaten away by Czech, who appeared to have misjudged it momentarily. Deflected this time. Czech comes, misses it. Breaks up Ashley Cole. One back by Torres. Referee's given a free kick to Chelsea, who are all over the place. Petacek is a bag of nerves. Drogba something to chase and, and Lampard something to run onto. 
Ben Yoon allowed to turn. Here goes Lucas. Check committed. It's never going to get there. This is Lucas Leiber. Check on the seat of his shorts. Crossed in by Fabio Aurelio. Turn behind by Ashley Cole. Goal kick. The ball had already gone out of play. Almost another terrible decision by Petacek. Well, I mean, I think he does brilliantly here, Lucas, because Liverpool were 10 to 1 against with the bookmakers to get through to the semi finals before tonight. And Elka squeezed it towards Drop. Oh, Red has lost it! And Chelsea have got a nerve settler. Dramatic night takes another turn. Doesn't make a big difference in many ways. Liverpool still need to score another goal to take it to extra time. But it's the best moment by a long way for Chelsea and the worst moment for a long way for Pepe Reina. I think it's going to make a huge difference for Chelsea's mindset, but it's a shocker from Pepe Reina. He just thinks it's going to be dealt with on the front post and he's not expecting it to find its way right through. Aurelio and Alonso got in each other's way. This is Maluda looking for a free kick and getting it. Yeah, Arbolo, I think, made it easy for the referee. Balak leaves it. Drogba strikes it! Side netting, side netting. The people celebrating all around us. <laughs> We've got people looking at us. But Drogba has got one back. It's Alex! Oh, that's in! That's in! And that could be the moment when this extraordinary tie turns finally away from Liverpool and Chelsea can begin to celebrate and enjoy. 2-2 on the night, Liverpool must score twice again. Can you hit a ball harder? I mean, Pepe Reina is in a decent position. I think he gets a reasonable view of it, but he still can't react to it in time. I mean, this is absolutely thumped from Alex. And Reina might be grateful he didn't get a hand to it. It might have taken it off. In towards Lucas Leiva. Fernando Torres, been a little bit quiet just recently. Mascherano with the shot. Check keeps it out. This is Gossi Benayoun. Headed away by Branislav Ivanovic. Still a bit jittery, Petr Pet Cech. Alonso, Arbeloa, body check by Ashley Cole, oh, and there's a card out, and Ashley Cole would miss the first leg of the semi-final. If Chelsea do go to the new Camp in two weeks' time, somebody else will have to mark Lionel Messi. Alonso will take the free kick, Czech has come for it, and that's Essien away. Maluda trying to dribble his way out of trouble. Drop bar in pursuit. Onside. Running away from Carragher. Didier drop bar. Michael Ballack! Pepe Reina to Liverpool's rescue. That could have sealed it. That could have left Liverpool leading three more. Well, I thought in Ballack's style, as we've seen in the past, I thought he was just going to put his instep right through it and smash it. They need to get people around him. Here he is. Oh, look at that! <laughs> what am I saying? What am I saying? On cue. Well, I mean, he had an unbelievable strike against Blackburn on Saturday, and I thought maybe he was going to do it again now. That's Florian Maluda. It's a wonderful run from the Frenchman. Skirtle got back there. Chelsea only have a corner. He did very, very well, Martin Skirtle, to get back. He's hurt himself in the process. But it was uh, brilliantly charged down. Essien and Carvalho came rushing out. Arbola has brought down Essien. It's going to be a yellow card for him. It will be a suspension. For Alvaro, Alvaro Arbeloa. Liverpool somehow. From Anelka in came Maluda and caught Lucas, but Liverpool have the ball, or they had. Alonso's giving it away to Balak. And now Didier Drogba. Pulled in. Lampard! Chelsea are heading for the new camp. The first half hour tonight was a story but this has been a script you just couldn't put down and it's Chelsea who are going to be the winners Maluda taking some steps back back in fact curls it well, that's why yeah I think Reina was always comfortable with that one as well Lucas Labour it's deflected and in 
minutes remaining. Liverpool need two more goals. It's 3-3 on the night. What a night. Well, it's one of those, he's bought the ticket, so he had a chance. I mean, he's, he's got plenty of room once he gets this back on his right foot. Could have been shut down quicker. They're going to do, I think. I think. Arbelo, though. Alex with the header away. It's as far as Alonso. And here's Albert Riera. It's a good one. Count! Liverpool are rolling away the stone again. The comeback kings are at it again. They need one more to go into the semi finals. Oh, incredible. Absolutely incredible. File under fiction. Essien into Drogba. Oh, almost found a way through the Lampard. Drogba! To see those two mighty teams coming together again. Liverpool have got to find a goal to prevent it. And Elka. Lampard! It's in! That should be that. Wow, how these two legs have opened up. I mean, what we've watched in previous seasons have been like chess. Riera to Fabio Aurelio. Check punches and goes! Headed off the line by Essien. Riera, it's a goal kick. Oh, just play another half hour. Let's have some more of this. <laughs> Wasn't in the first, but they responded, and it's been enough. Half time was the best tonic for them. Even by Liverpool and Chelsea standards, this has been an epic. It will be Gus Hiddink who takes Chelsea through to the semi-finals in a night when it rained goals. 4-4 the final score. It's Chelsea by 7-5 on aggregate. Discuss that.